exception, this is your afternoon maths lesson. So today we are going to be looking at number bonds within five. So number bonds is a number pair. So it's two numbers that join together to make a sum. And the sum that we're looking at today is five. Okay, so we're going to look for all the number bonds to make five. So what I would like you to do is draw a spider diagram. So I want your number in the middle. And then I want you to put some arrows round the outside. So there are six ways to make five. So you need six arrows. And then I will show you how we're going to work it out practically together. Okay, so I want everyone working out the number sentences to five. However, if your child has done this really quick and confidently, then they move, may move on to finding the number bonds to ten, which some children will. So go through this, see how you think they did with it, and then you can move them on to ten. So you draw another spider gram, but that time there are twelve ways of making ten, so you need twelve arrows, okay? So if you can pause the video and go and draw your spider diagrams ready, please, and then come and press play and I'll show you how we're going to work them out today. So, on the carpet again, you will need some cubes again, or some objects to add, okay? And I've got five cubes out, because that is how many I am working with. However, if you were working with the ten, then you will need ten cubes. So. I've got my add and my equals, and we are working up to five. So I'm going to put five at the end, or if you're working up to ten, you'll need to put a ten. Move that so you can see it. Okay, so how we're going to do it is you are going to take a cube away, and then do that number sentence. And then again, you'll take two away, then you'll take three away, then you'll take four away. So let's do the first one together, because it's nice and easy. So... It's all about being able to put the cubes in the number sentence, read the number sentence, and then fill it in on your diagram. So our first one, we're going to do one, add the rest of your cubes. So can you count how many cubes are there? Nice and easy, four. Okay, so you're going to do one, add four, equals five. So that is your first number bond to five. So you will go back to your spider diagram and write it on. And then you're going to come back to the carpet where it's practical and take your cubes back. So we did have one cube, but this time you're going to have two cubes. So each time add a cube. So you've got your two here and the rest of your cubes go there. So this time let's read our number sentence again. So we've got two, add three equals Five. So there is your second number sentence. So when you have found the number sentence, I want you to come back to your spider diagram and I want you to write it down. So our first one was one add, can you remember? Well, I write it, one add four equals five. So there's your first number bond within five. What was the second one that we've just done? Can you remember? Two add three. So two add three equals five. And then I want to see if you can find the rest on your own, okay? So again, if you find these really easy, move on to ten. So I'm just going to do some practically on the floor with up to ten, just to show you. Did you want to have a look? So this time... We're going to change our card because we're looking up to 10 and we're going to need 10 cubes, okay? So I've already got 5, 10. Brilliant. So again, you are just going to do the same just to find out all the different ways to make 10. So start with 1 and put all of them there. So it's a much bigger group now, so you might have to count them. So 1, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so can you read the number sentence for me? One, add nine equals ten. Brilliant, so you found your first way to make ten. So again, back to your spider diagram. You're going to do one, add nine equals ten. Okay, and remember, 
Sometimes people forget the one that I want you to find is what? Zero add equals 10, okay? So zero add, that one's really easy. I'm not gonna say that one, you should just know that one in your head. If not, work it out with your cubes, go back. So zero means nothing, so you've got nothing. Add 10 equals, you should know that one's super easy, so please don't forget that one, okay? So I want you to find all the number bonds within five, all the number bonds within 10, and show them in a nice spider diagram for me, okay? And then, once you've done that, take a picture, upload it so I can have a look. I want you to play a little game, okay? Because again, your number bonds is something that we're working on for quick mental recall. So it's a game called I Say, You Say, okay? So what you'll do with your adult is your adult will say a number, and you have to say the number that we add with that number to make 10 or five. So I'll start with five. So I would go, I say four, you say, and you'd say one, because with four, we add one and it makes five, okay? So if you're doing, I say three, you say two, because when we've got three, we add two to make five, okay? So it's a just quick game of that, again with 10, I say five, you say five. I say nine, you say one. I say zero, you say 10. Okay, so it's just a nice quick game to get that recall, okay? So I know it was a quick video today, but it was just to show you how to work out and then write it down. So what I'd like you to do now is go off the video independently, set up how to do it, and then I want you to practice them get all your number sentences and then have a go at I say, you say, okay? And I will be looking for all your pictures, so upload your pictures. Again, add a little comment on to just let me know how they're getting on. Do they know the recall? Do they need some more practical work? Just let me know, okay? Any questions, just message me and I will see you again soon. Bye.